What's up everybody? This is Zach from Zach's Hockey Box here with uh, another retail box opening of 2020-2021 Series 2. Hoping to pull a Kirill Capriz off. It's still amazing to me to this point in time that I have not pulled a second one. So hopefully this is the box. I'm hoping I'm hoping this is the box that has that Kirill Capriz off young gun. Cause maybe maybe I because I think I pulled it in our first I, I think it was the first box I ever opened of this set. It was, a, it was a hobby box. It was the first one I ever opened. That's the only Kirill Kaprizov Young Gun I have pulled to this date. And to me, that's just crazy because I've opened a lot of this. So maybe we can finally make this the one to do it. And I've never pulled it out of a retail box. It was out of one hobby box. So uh, it would be nice to pull it out of a retail box. Nice little cap off for, for these two boxes, but let's get into it and see what happens. First pack is a uh, bunch of bulk. Which because I think that's where the bulk pack was in the last box. I probably go back and rewatch that video. In the first box open of this, uh, I think it I think that was the bulk pack, was the first one on the on the right side there. Interesting. Maybe we got a dead box, because we got another bulk pack. Interesting. Interesting, interesting. Well, hopefully that's the only two uh, bulk packs we have. It's kit. All right, we got Alexander Romanoff for the young gun in that pack, which is disappointing because I think he may be the one that you get like the, the like one, I guess, kind of hit of the box. You usually get like one hard to hit young gun and like six other ones. But uh, we'll, we'll keep going. We'll see. We'll see. Maybe maybe we'll get like nope, because there's Tim Stutzla. Okay. I will take that. But again, no Kirill Kaprizov probably. That's what that means in that box. Because <laughs> I'm pretty sure Tim Stutzla is usually the uh, the one you get for that. Like the, the no hit or like is like the major hit. Ooh, Gustav Lindstrom, the uh, now Montreal Canadian. But yeah, so that's just playing the. No Kirill Kaprizov, probably. Again, we'll, we'll keep going. We'll keep going. The jersey. I was hoping the jersey might have been a uh, uh, good luck charm. I've done that before. If, again, if you guys are new to the channel, I've done where I've worn jerseys of the teams I've been trying to pull or the players I'm trying to pull for those teams. It's worked a few times. Sometimes it doesn't. We've got an Alec Rugula. Blue marquee rookie. So that's what I was hoping for. That's why I'm wearing my, uh, the Minnesota Wild. That's pretty much the, the reasoning behind it. And I haven't worn this jersey in a while. One of my favorites. Got a normal Alec Rugula. It's one of my favorite jerseys. I, I love I love the Minnesota Wild logo. I love the colors. The colors green is my favorite. So it is definitely one of those that I, I wear quite often. We got a checklist of Kachucks together, and we got a Brock Besser. He's having quite a season this year for the Vancouver Canucks. Man. With the five all-star appearances or five all-stars they have in first place man that team is uh looking pretty pretty good quinn hughes looking phenomenal there we got ourselves a david perron the current red wing wearing that nice retro blues jersey but yeah the canucks i'm, I'm so happy for quinn hughes uh, elias Pettersson, brock fester jt miller that team has been through a lot the last few years so it's cool to see them actually like having a having a good season william Ligason, I believe, if I'm saying that, for, I'm really pronouncing that right. William Ligason for the Edmonton Oilers. But yeah, it's nice to see them actually doing really good and looking like a team that could maybe go pretty far. Uh, we'll, we'll see uh, Alec Rugula, Young Gun. Apparently the Alec Rugula box. So excited to see what the, the, the playoffs this year I'm, I'm excited about for many reasons, but very, very excited about what the, this, this playoffs look like. It could be Connor McMichael, Retro Marquee Rookie. Because the playoffs, I just I don't know who I don't, I don't know who I'd pick to win the cup at this point. Like when I go do my brackets in you know a few months or whatever, I I don't I don't know who I'm gonna pick. Pavel Francouz, retro rookie. Because there's just so many, there's so many like teams that like look really good, but then they don't look really good. So I mean like Vancouver's looked phenomenal this whole entire like season, Vitek Vanacek, but. Usually those are the teams that don't do great like a look at Boston last year Like they had one of the best regular seasons in NHL history and then all of a sudden blew away, you know, three game league or whatever it was over the four Panthers and Yeah, uh, I don't know. It's, it's really hard to tell these days, which is probably one of my favorite things. Peyton Krebs, marquee rookie 
about hockey is that it's so hard to tell who's going to win a cup, who's going to like really go far in the playoffs. Because like Toronto, again, another team that looks really good, go to the playoffs and they just struggle every year. They 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 seem like they have it again and they don't. Ooh, Connor Ingram portrait. Like some Connor Ingram cards. I'm honestly, I know that Arizona's probably not going to win the playoffs this year, but I mean, I, that team is fun to watch. It is a fun team. Clayton Keller, Logan Cooley, uh, Nick Schmaltz, Jensen Harkins portrait. It is a fun team. It, I, I highly recommend if you guys do not watch Arizona Coyotes games, catch some of them. They are a lot of fun to watch. A good young team. Connor Ingram looks great. Like Again, like they have some struggles here and there. Mackenzie Entwinsel for the Blackhawks. But overall, that team is a lot of fun to watch. And uh, I think they will be something to watch in the future. And, yeah, definitely definitely a team to watch. Oh, nice. Stutzla and Cousins checklist there. And a Jack Hughes Dazzler. All right. Nice double banger right there. We'll take that, too. Got a Dazzler and a double banger in one of the other packs, too, didn't we? Like, I can't remember what we got in the last box. But I think we got a Dazzler with a young gun in that box, too, didn't we? Yeah, a lot of duplicate kind of things going on here. We got ourselves a Artem Anisimov canvas. So it doesn't look like we're going to get any rookie canvases. That's disappointing. But you win some, you lose some. You don't always get the, the young gun canvas in a box. But uh, we'll we'll take the uh, the Romanov and the Stutzla young guns. We got ourselves a Matt Dumba, who's on the Arizona Coyotes team that I've been talking about. So that's a nice little tie into what I was just talking about. And also matching the logo on it. Okay. I see your box. I see your, your, you're picking up what I'm laying down. Got ourselves, it looks like another mark. Oh, sorry. We got an award winner. It's a Bobby Ryan. The year where he came back and he won the award for um, perseveration, perseverance. Perseverance. There we go. Got there. Uh, dedication to the hockey. This is the last path away. I've just been rambling, going through cards. So let's see what we got. We got ourselves a Dazzler. So we got Thomas Harley, Marquee Rookie, and a Braden Point Dazzler. So let's see if that's part of the piece, if we need that for the piece here. Now, we only needed one of the ones in the last box. I think the, what was the one? Liam Foodie. The Liam Foodie Dazzler from the last box. The only one we need for the PC. So I put that in the box. The rest of them went into the bulk box. It's down here for, like, rookie-type cards or, like, inserts that people might be interested in. When we do shows, we can I can bring that out and sell some of those off for cheap, whatever, just to kind of help you know, fill the table, get some cards out to people that need those uh, inserts along the way. Like, um, there are a lot of a lot of rookie card type cards in there. But anyways, thanks for watching, guys. This has been Zach Sox Hockey Box. Uh, really quick video. Appreciate all the thumbs up, comments, all that stuff. And uh, I will look for you guys again very, very soon.